First thing you do is download Putty, which is free. Put the link in the description. So put Putty into your search, P-U-T-T-Y, and then open the app like so. That's what it looks like. And then put in the IP address of your node. So if you look at your Supermon page, my IP address is 192.168.0.101. That's all you need. Just minimize that, go back to this page here. So we'll go 192.168.0.101. And we need to put three twos in here and then click open. And it will start to log you in. So the login when you're in putty is small letters root. Click enter. And then password is all star a l l s t a r you don't see it on the screen but it's gone in and you hit enter and if you've done it correct you'll get this screen and the very first one at the top says perform a system update so internet access required we know that so click run selected item retrieve the latest system updates click yes and then just wait i'll leave it live it might take a while um so um is that it? Let's just click it again. Looks like it's already done it. I didn't see any errors. Run selected item. Retrieve the latest system. Yes. It's up to date. It's saying that everything's up to date. And that's it. You're all up to date. So I hope this helps you with your Supermon. I mean, Supermon is very good. You do, you know, if you want to get yourself a node, or you can even make yourself an all star node, they work so well. Some are radio less, but generally people buy. Uh, have them with uh, a Raspberry Pi 3B. They have a sound card and a Bofeng radio and it transmits a signal throughout your house and you can have all these connections and the one we're connected to at the moment is m 0 hy Hubnet but you can put in any number here. You do get your own number so you have to register with All Star and get yourself uh, a number as well. Loads of info on uh, on this whole Superman and All Star but for me it was a, a very big improvement to my hobby. So 7-3 Thanks for watching my channel and catch you on air.